Si tú sabes lo que se le pide a Ogre, she's not. No. 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 You don't want to sleep? No. No? No, yeah. No, we're no. not going to sleep? No. No? But you have to, you have to take your nap, Buba. A booba. No, Buba. I don't think so, Buba. No? Okay. We're going to take her to sleep anyways. No, no. <laughs> You can see Zuri. Zuri is sleeping finally. So now we can finally shoot this video. But I'm waiting for my husband to come because, yeah, takes forever as well. So we have to wait for Giuseppe to arrive. But in the meantime, I'm gonna go through these messages that were sent in. Oh, very nice of you to join us. Am I late for the show? You're late, actually. Can I still enter the show? Yeah. You can. Go ahead. Hello there. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> How are y'all doing? <laughs> so what are we doing today? Are you going to sit down or are you just going to squat like this? The whole I like time? squatting. It's good for my glutes. <laughs> what glutes? He says I have no bum because I'm white. I didn't say that. <laughs> That's not that. That's what you said. <laughs> you have no ass for white people have no ass. I said it. There. I, I, I said it. I didn't say that. Hey guys. What's up? Welcome back to our channel. I'm Avoke and I'm Giuseppe. Yeah, so we we're going to be reading some assumptions people have about us. This is like a new video tag that has been going on on YouTube and you guys know that. I love or we love do you like you like tags right because you're like we have a lot of vlogs up we should like sit down and have like a sheet chat kind of video and we thought this tag is going to be a fun tag so I posted on YouTube and on an Instagram page that you guys should send us like um, like uh, assumptions that you guys have about Did us we receive some weird ones we I haven't checked all of them but we've received some First of all, I just want to say that the ones that I've seen so far is, have surprised me. You guys actually surprised me because I've read them. I haven't read them. I know. <laughs> Are they nice? Are I they did, sweet? I didn't expect, I did not expect the amount Did of... anybody make any stupid assumptions? Just, let's just read We're going to shame you properly. We're going to write your name here. We're going to post your name. <laughs> and we're going to shame you. Everybody's gonna join into the shame. Alright? Are we a normal couple? I would think so. What yeah. do you guys think of us anyway? I would think when, so. When when you see us, like do you assume like we're weird or are we modern? Are we old fashioned? Are we different? I don't know. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? It's really Are funny. we like good role models? Do you think we're good parents? Well let us know. <laughs> Okay, so no, let me first of all, first of all, the main, uh, the main one assumption that the most, of, the most, most often, often one out of mm -hmm. like almost seventy messages, on both combined YouTube and and um, Instagram and Instagram was they are assuming that I am currently pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> Like at this point, really? yeah, yeah literally. She lost weight lately. How can you assume she's pregnant? At this point, like, I think that you guys are just thinking that I'm. Maybe they think it's so I because it's Zuri. because it's 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 been a, in a minute. Zuri's been around for a minute, so maybe it's time for number two. Is that I, why, or because that, of your look? No, look at me. I think I've lost weight. I'm literally in yeah, my in my fittest stage right now. Ever since I had Zuri, like I'm looking so funny. fit. I'm feeling myself. At this point, I really don't know why people would think that I am pregnant and I'm trying to hide it. Literally, a lot of people guess. assume that I'm currently pregnant. So, are you going to answer the question? Because we need to answer yes oh. or no. So, the answer is no. no. She's not pregnant no. yet. The second one is, are we planning to get pregnant this year? So those are like the two most common assumptions. No, they assume that we are planning to get pregnant this year. This year as in 2019? As in 2019 or we are currently planning to have a baby this year. Are you going to answer that? 
Well, first of all, uh, you can plan all you want, but everything is always in God's hands, you oh, know? You see, this is why I married this man. That is exactly the answer I wanted to give. Really? Yes. Oh. I think we think alike, you I know. Think alike. That is so true what he said. I'm thinking, let's go upstairs and. Are you thinking that too? No, no. nothing. <laughs> <that. laughs> you see this man. We don't think alike at all. No. <laughs> Literally, like like he said, we humans, we can plan all we want, but if God says no time, it's no time. And with us, what we've really seen with us is things happen in their own time. Like you can plan all you want. Yeah. It's just when God says it's the time, it's gonna happen. Yeah. But definitely, we want to have a, we want to like have a. A family, of course. We want to have Zoe, Zoe to have a, a uh, sibling. She, no, we don't. Yeah, that's for uh, sure. So, uh, but um, we'll see. We haven't. Uh, yeah, set right. Set a date yet? I assume that Giuseppe is not comfortable with his age. How did you even come up with that? Well, I do feel I do, I'm I. I do feel younger than my age, so sometimes when I get confronted with my age and, and I'm like, mm, doesn't sound right, I feel younger. It's true. I don't like to talk about it, so maybe that's why the person said think, it. Oh yeah, I get so. Think I think so. the assumption is right. I guess. Not that I'm not comfortable with my age, I mean I feel good for my age. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Um, someone said they assume that I am a talkative. Okay. Really? Yeah. You? Yeah, me. Guys, let me tell you the truth. Oh my God. Let me tell you the truth about no, this we're one not right doing here. This story. Let me tell you the truth. No. So, when I met her, Sheesh. way back, she, there was, I loved her, and I was crazy about her. There was this one thing that was like always like mm, annoying. That is that she was so quiet. Okay, I would take her to dinner. And I, she literally just sit there and eat and not say a word, you know. So I always had to ask her questions like this, that, that to poke her to to make her talk. So and she's changed. She talks more now, but she is still some very quiet individual. She can just sit next to you for hours and not say anything. On the other hand, me, I'll be like. But I'm a person. Is that for me? But she's not rude, like now if you go to a party and she's with a friend, she's talkative, she's joins in and everything. That's cool. But uh, before she was super quiet and I've always been the more talkative one. Yeah, I think I have two kind of personalities. Like when I'm, when I'm comfortable around people, I tend to talk a lot, like around my friends and family. But when I don't know you at first and... I've never met you. I intend to be a little bit. I uh, keep to myself, but yeah, I wouldn't. No, I'm not a talkative person. No. So someone says you hate changing. They assume that you hate changing diapers. Me? That is so. I'm gonna answer that. That is so far out of this. This man here. I love diapers, man. This man here. <laughs> okay, I don't love diapers, but he he. So, we do this. I think he even do like changing more diapers than I do. No, like guys. I've been sick for the past five days, right? And he has been taking care of Zuri, like from everything to changing her, to dressing her, to feeding her. So yeah. No, guys. Maybe that's like I, I understand the assumption. Because but why would it no, that? I would. I had the same assumptions before I had a kid. I think, oh my God, all those diapers and shit it must be very terrible. But I then I didn't realize yet what I realize now. Changing diaper is a moment. You're having a moment with your kid, right? You put her down, you play with her a little bit, you look at your kid in the eye, and the smell. Yes, it's penetrating. Sometimes you almost faint and everything. You just try not to faint, but you get used to it. It's your kid. You know, it's okay. Changing diapers is fun, guys. Whatever you guys say. I don't care. Assume that you are very protective of me. Ooh. Hmm. Yeah. What do you do? Well, you answer that one. Yeah, he can be very protective in some certain ways. Like, and I know that he will, like, he. He gives me the room to do whatever I want, but sometimes when I'm doing something that he doesn't like necessarily That doesn't like connect with his principle. He would tell me that No, I don't want you to do this. Oh, no, I don't feel comfortable you doing this 
so in those ways he's very protective of me but it's not like in a negative way that you're not allowed to do this you're not allowed to do that that was like more in the beginning of the relationship right you were very young and maybe all you wanted to and I was like a little more mature and experienced so I just advised you like yeah you can do that but it's not really smart or I never really put it in a way I always give it a choice mm -hmm. it wasn't like it's not like no you're not doing that I always say like you can do it but listen up this is what I think about it do whatever you want with it yeah yeah. And of course you're protective, I mean, if, if you don't, yeah, you're yeah. a man of the family, so you need to protect your family. Yeah, definitely. Like, he is protective in a positive way. Yeah. Like he genuinely just care about his family. So, another assumption, this assumption was so, so crazy, yeah? Someone assumed that all our friends have white partners. You, you want to answer or no, you want you to? No, you can answer. Well, you know, of course, um, people who follow us know that we have some close friends who are coincidentally in an interracial relationship right we have a few friends that are uh, a mixed couple um, and some mixed couples maybe tend to look at other mixed couples for inspiration or maybe other couples in other countries are dealing with uh, maybe conflicts or uh, because we live in Holland we don't really have that here maybe some people uh, mixed couples they live in a country where there's a little bit of racial issues so they tend to people likewise to see how they deal with it I understand a little bit like everybody tends a little bit towards the same people like for example if you like uh, perfumes you tend to follow groups of people who like perfumes it, it, it's, it's like a natural thing mm -hmm. but do we specifically go out and look for mixed friends absolutely not that's no. ridiculous we have friends from basically our friends is just one big culture thing. yeah from India to, to Africa to America to Dutch to everything we don't even care where you're from we yeah. just open-minded people and we connect with personalities not on culture not on looks not on nothing so if we coincidentally have a lot of mixed couples maybe because there's a lot out there nowadays but we don't even like recognize them unless you guys tell us it's a mixed couple we don't even look at it like that no we look at them like friends mm -hmm. and and i and i just to add a little not to make this too long but that's there's something that i don't people need to understand that we we live in the netherlands not every youtube interracial couples you see are from the united states and and i know you guys have a certain way you think about you have your own opinions about interracial relationship and it's super different here so i really the thing is that i really don't understand because the only couple that we've actually officially showed in this channel is jack and jen so how can one just assume from seeing one of our friends and assume that all like literally she stated all of our friends oh, I, mean, it's, I think it's 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 quite a very naive assumption but to answer your question no miss we have friends from yeah all over the world we don't see colors anymore no we don't we're all human we are all humans thank you baby someone said um we have zoom this is off we have zoom your darts are not around that's why you don't show them that much yeah sad story right we're not gonna talk about that <laughs> that's a video for another day yeah of course uh that's uh of course it's a sad story but maybe uh a, a video for another day delicate topic yeah. but yeah our dads are not around anymore that's the short answer yeah and uh, we surely can do uh, if you're into guys interested just let us know we can do a little bit of family background video once. Yeah. So if you guys want to know our backgrounds a little bit more, uh, where we come from, where our parents come from, just let me just let us know if you guys are interested. We can do a video on that. Yeah, that's that's could be a video of its yeah. own. But yeah, that's good. People actually notice it. Okay. Yeah. My assumption is that Zuri is young, and you put and you have put pushes in a home up so that Pino's mother. Okay. Is okay. Close by to help. Iva, buying a home is one of your goals. Is that yes or no? Wow. That is, that's, that's quite accurate. That's spot on. That's Somebody like, knows us. That's, I'm telling you, she's our number one fan. I love this woman. Like, well, I it, pray it, that it, I meet you one day. I love her so much. Like, I look forward to our <laughs> comments. Seriously. That's sweet. Um, so, uh, the answer is, well, spot on, like I said. Um, yeah, we, we uh, this is our first kid and uh, we wanted the, the help of my mother uh, with the first kid. So, uh, we definitely stayed uh, at my mom's house for a while now. And... Um, we're slowly looking into relocating. Now Zuri is getting bigger, mm -hmm. and my mother is getting older. 
uh, you know, I also want to give my mom a break. Uh, she's always want to play and always want to help out, but that's mm -hmm. not fair at a certain age. Yeah. So we decided to slowly, slowly start looking around for a house. Yeah, so definitely that was... Without rush though. That's definitely a goal for... Yeah. yeah. This is again, I'm assuming that your husband loves you a lot. Do you love Why him? would you assume that? Of course. Why would you think that? <laughs> Don't you love me? Of course. Mm. Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes. I always love you. Sometimes I dislike you. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> of course I love her. Come this on, look at her. She's so sweet. Isn't she the sweetest girl I've ever, ever, ever seen? Save my head. Oh, you're gonna, you're gonna ruin she's my, sweet. Gonna, What's there not to love? You're gonna ruin my tongue, man. My tongue. She's sweet 28 days a month. <laughs> it is. It is. <laughs> the, the other ones? I'm gone. Yes, hide, hide. <laughs> Don't be mean. PMS is not even a not a joke. No, Don't you start. you are mean is PMS. Don't start with me. Someone assume you call your mother every day. Well, <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> well, as much as I want to, I'm, I remain an Italian boy. Yeah, yeah. I have Italian blood. My mother raised me. <laughs> so yeah, okay. You guys, to be honest, of course, and I think it's a good thing. Another one. One said, "You, you are still my favorite YouTube couples. Aww. No assumptions yet. Keep Aww. being real." Oh, thank this, you. These are the cutest things. It's like I have a short prayer. Oh, pray for us. May God preserve and keep your family. May your love for each other never die. Aww. And may God increase you in all rem, rem, rem what is this? Sorry, reminifications of life. Mm. Amen. Thank Amen you. Amen to that, sister. Thank you. Amen to that. So someone assume that I come off to be a jealous person. A jealous like I can be very like jealous. Yeah. You She's so jealous. <laughs> Seriously. Like I could, I could be jealous of. <laughs> like yesterday we watched a when movie. When I see him with someone was a naked, else. There was a naked lady in a movie, and I was like, and she was looking at me like, like what? <laughs> she was already jealous. Like seriously, like why wouldn't you be jealous if you see your husband with some random person? Not, I won't call myself a jealous person, but obviously I, I can be also be protective of that aspect, like back that. F up like <laughs> don't 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 come further. Yes, that I can do. Oh, so cute. Am I a jealous person? So no, on a serious note, because you know YouTube people they take all these things super literal. No, I mean jealous. There's the different skills of jealousy. Yeah, right. I mean I've seen jealous people that go like mental that go check your phones and those those kind of things. Yeah. We're not talking about that, okay guys? Yeah. That is like obsessive jealousy. That's not me. That's not what we're talking about. Mm -hmm. We trust each other 100%. We don't check each other's phone. We're talking about if you really like, if I would be flirting with a girl, would you be jealous? Yeah, obviously. Yeah, that's kind of thing. Yeah. More the obvious kind of thing. Not, yes. not the obsessive jealousy. We don't do that. No, we no. don't. Uh, pretty much the rest are pretty much people just basically telling us they don't have assumptions about us They're the lovers. They want us to remain the same. So I'm really we are really 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 that's quite um I'm, I'm, I'm positively amazed. I'm I am like, so amazed. I was I'm scared actually... people was gonna assume like stupid things, uh, maybe. Uh, but uh, it's all love. It's good. It's all love. I we, I never expected this amount of positivity. Positive, yeah. I know there's not much people out there with wrong assumptions about us. About us. That is that is. That's good. the conclusion. You know because of the video. Okay, <laughs> yeah, that is good, right? So yeah, that's it. Thank you guys so so much for sending your assumptions and thank you guys for the prayers. Thank you guys for wishing us. A baby, I think it's a good thing that you guys are out there actually wishing for us to have to expand our family. I think we should just go and give it to them, so the baby. So let's go. <laughs> Bye, guys. This is what I have to do with. Bye. <laughs> but anyways, thank you, guys. <laughs> we need to. Okay. We need to say goodbye. Make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet. You haven't subscribed yet? I don't know. Have you guys subscribed? Really? <laughs> Because I don't know. Really? And you haven't told your friends about us as well? Uh, did they? Did you, you So you say you support us, but you don't tell your friends to subscribe Did you to even share our videos? That's a little disappointing. Oh, did you even follow us on Instagram? 
They don't? I do not know. Shame on you. Do you guys? Shame on you. But anyways, I'm just going to put it right We love here. you anyways, but... So you can click on it and go follow us. Subscribe anyways. us. And, follow and subscribe. Us. <laughs> All right. Cool. We'll have to go. Thank you, guys. Bye.